Hello! And welcome to the stream! The last stream we played a whole bunch of DVD and then I had to cancel stream because I had dinner and I didn't want the dinner to be cold and I also didn't want you guys to be bored while I ate my dinner, so stream ended. Also, we lost like the majority of our matches are drawn, so that's... That's not very... Entertaining. Usually people like watching other people win. No one really likes pe watching people lose. Oh well. Anyway, what are we doing today? We're gonna be going back into Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and today's task, get all the climbing gear, because, well, I don't like climbing very slowly. It's very annoying. So I'm just gonna go and get all the gear. And I now know where the other two are, because I looked it up. Haha. -ha. And now I'm gonna show you where it is. Haha. -ha. Amazing. So that way you can get the climbing gear as well, and then you can climb very, very fast. Mmm, yes. Amazing. Wonderful. Without further ado, let's get into the game. P mute this. No, it's not muted. Please mute. Noted. My stream deck does not have the mute function anymore, so I have to mute it manually. Joy. So, game scene, pause, and mute desktop. There we go. Fantastic. And now it should work correctly. Me thinks, me hopes. That's what it's looking like. Do do do, do 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 do. Yes, fantastic. Do, 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 do. So we are going to be going and getting the um. Well, not only are we going to be getting that, but then we're also going to be running around and filling out the map. And then once that's done, we're gonna probably try to go for the Master Sword. But yeah, that is the goal. Get climbing gear, because the climbing gear will make it very easy to climb up the rest of the towers. And then we'll do something else. But yeah, now we're in Kakariko Village. Goodbye, Kakariko Village. I didn't want to be here anyway. But that means we do have to go up here, so we can just teleport over here. We don't have to travel all the way over there. No, we use fast travel to cut out all the boring stuff. Do do do. Ha da hamar shrine joy. And I'll have to resummon my horse. How do I resummon the horse? You just go back to the stable and you talk to the person and they bring you back your horse. Hey Beetle. How you doing? Come on over. I can give you directions. Now I'm good. Welcome to our stable. We serve our horse. Rest. Blah, blah, blah. So what will be? I want to take a horse. So you want to take out? I want to take out Troy. Mm -hmm. You want to Troy, right? Yep. Gonna take the horse. All right. We'll get Troy ready for you. Blah, 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 blah. As they magically summon my horse over. Thank you. Ah. And there you go. Thanks for choosing us for all your hey. horsey needs. If you get separate from your horse, just whistle and I'll come running. Is it magic? Blah, blah, blah. Thank you. Mm. It's a cuckoo. Hmm, what is it, good sir? Hmm. Oh, sorry. I didn't notice you. I was a bit lost in thought there. I've been doing rigorous research day and night to figure out the mystery of that blood moon. Blood moon? You don't know it? That's inexcusable. Listen up and I'll tell you about it. For a hundred years now, every so often, when the clock strikes midnight, the sky turns red and a full moon rises. At that moment, monsters that have been previously defeated will come back to life. Huh. And that's what is known as the Blood Moon. Oh, why do the monsters return to life? Why does it only happen when the sky turns red? No one really has the answers to those questions. It's a mysterious phenomenon caused by Ganon. Oh. If you learn anything about the Blood Moon as you travel, be sure to come back and tell me. Okay, I will. Do -do -do. Do -do 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 -do. Hello. Uh. Hmm, I bet it's over there. Oh, really? I've got the scoop on Misko's treasure, and it's great. Listen up, Dak. Oh. Prison, hang on. Hmm? Hey, buddy, what's your problem? You aren't incredibly rude and listening to our conversation, are you? That is exactly what I'm doing. Ho oh, oh. ho. Ha 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 ha. Do do do. Do do do. We're treasure hunters on the trail of our latest score, the treasure of the great bandit Misko. It's as good as ours. Uh -huh. Preston, you're going to give it all away. Uh -huh. 
Sorry, Dak. I got carried away. Yeah, just a little bit. Anyway, we're busy here, dude. <laughs> dude. Uh, if you need something, take it up with someone else. Okay. Rupees over rubies. Yeah. Have you ever been to the Dueling Peaks? Yes, yes, I have. Those mountains are really rich in ore. I want to go out there with a trusty hammer and really mine up a fortune. I can see it now. Big piles of gems stacked neatly as far as the eye can see. A buyer giving me tons of rupees. Oh, sorry. When I think about gems, I just get so excited. Hmm. You again? Pay no mind to my little brother's chatter from before. He's got a penchant for running his mouth with crazy talk. So... Miss Ghost Treasure? Ah, shoot. Well, can't say I didn't try to throw him off. Ah. Hey, Dak, why don't we just tell him? Maybe he'll leave us alone if we do. Excuse me, I mean, if we can't figure this riddle out, there's no way someone like him will be able to. That's where you are wrong, for I am the gamer. Ah. That's a good point. We're after nothing less than the treasure of Misko, the Great Bandit. Finding it would mean incredible riches. I'm not going to give this information away for free. I'm no fool. Oh. That's the keen sense of the strongest treasure hunter at work. No gold left behind, not by Domadak. You're great, Dak. Yay. Oh. It'll be 100 rupees to learn what we know. Truth is, it'd be a steal to get this exclusive scoop for 1,000 rupees. So what do you say? No way, because I already know where it is. Anyway, Misko's treasure, not that we were talking about such a thing, is only for the best of treasure hunters. That probably rules you out, bub. The fewer people after it, the better. And we've still got the scoop. Do -do 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 -do. I know where it is. Do -do -do. Do -do 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 -do. It's over there, <laughs> by the way, for anyone want wondering. What you have to do is you go on this bridge, right? You follow this second river. Right, this one, I believe. And you just follow it. Hello, Octorok. Goodbye, Octorok. Right? Yeah, you see that, that strange rock that doesn't match the rest of it? Yeah, that's where it is. That's Misko's treasure. <laughs> yeah, now we just have to climb up there. After we go blast fishing. Yep. Oh. Yep. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Staminoka bass obtained. Thank you very much. Ooh, an armored carp. Calcium deposits in the scales of this ancient fish make them as hard as armor. Cooking it into a dish will fortify your bones, temporarily increasing your defense. Oh, whoops, no, didn't want to do that. Let me guess. This is a... What you call it, right? Yeah, it's a Korok. You found me. Korok seed. Bye bye there you go, buddy. Ouch. <laughs> Hot-footed frog. A quick frog that can be found hopping around near water. Cook it with monster parts to draw its speed-boosting effect. Interesting. Ooh, grow that there. So I now have a place that I can stand. Get my stamina back. I don't think I can make another one, though. Can use it as, this as a jump-off point to climb up here. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. I just need to get up up here. And up. Yeah, there are, the, there are those rocks that we saw from a very far distance away. A whole bunch of silent shrooms, too. Place this here. Run over here. Blow it up. Oh, what's this? Let's see. A sapphire, a precious blue gem mined from natural rock formations. Sapphires contain the very essence of ice. They've been known to fetch a high price since ancient times. You know, I usually have them 
I usually associate sapphires with water because, well, blue. Luminous stone. This mysterious mineral gives off a pale blue glow in the dark, which some believe to be souls of the dead. Apparently, this stone can be used as a base to make special clothing. It's also used for various upgrades as well. Toasted hearty truffle. A hearty truffle with a toasted crispy outside and a warm gooey inside. Yay. What's this? Soldier's Spear. A long spear once used by the guards of Hyrule Castle. Easy to use, but difficult to master. The iron tip is very sturdy, and the chef will will not burn when exposed to flame. Ah, but I have I've already maxed out my weapons. Ah, a shame. Do -do -do. Amber. Thank you. What's this? Opal. Yes, yes. And another sapphire. Okay. We Blow that up. What's over here? Flame Blade! This magical sword was forged in the lava of Death Mountain. It leaves white-hot flames in its wake when the blade glows red. Your inventory is full. Dang it! I don't need the stick! Get out of here! I'm gonna have a fire sword! Uh, I really need another claymore. Eh. So you have a soldier's claymore, traveler's claymore. I don't really need the traveler's claymore. See you later. Actually, no, what? I'll keep it. You can always use some more claymores. Not only that, but when the hammer breaks, you, you need to use the two handed weapons to break the rocks. I now have this cool sword. Seared steaks. Very nice. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Not that, but the thing with the elemental weapons is that you don't actually want to whack people with them. What you want to do is you want to apply the element and then you do something else, I believe. Then you just swap out to another weapon and you, and you whack them with that. Okay, where's the shrine exactly? It is up. Noted. Um... I don't really see any other footholds that I can use as pit stops along the way. Hmm, maybe there. Yeah, that looks like one that would work. But, problem, I need to get over there first. Let's see how high I can actually get up without anything else. There we go. So I'm probably going to need some stamina food if I am actually going to want to scale this, which is unfortunate. Do I even have any? I do not. Okay. Well, that lets me know what I got to do now. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Yo, rush room, though. Speed tonics. Everyone likes a speed tonic. Damn Octorox. Damn skull foes. Wait, no, these are these are stall foes. Yo, truffle! Yo, oh, wait, no, that's not a truffle. Dang it. They're just iron shrooms. Oh well. You missed. Ooh! Big boy! Okay. What the hell are you? Oh, don't mind me, good sir. I'm just gonna go for this treasure chest. Thank you very much. Purple rupee. 50 rupees. Its violet glow fills your heart with generosity. Yeah. I don't think I have the stuff to deal with him yet. Eightful Blade is badly damaged. Oh, come on, Eightful Blade. Why you do this? Horses. Ooh, that's a way up there, though. Instead of just having to climb up the original area, I can just do this instead. Climb up an area that has multiple stoppings. Alrighty, and we start going. Hmm. 
That's another thing. I believe if you see Link scaling it more like he's crawling than he's doing the shimmy right now, I believe that means you can actually let go and regain your stamina. All right, you just have to keep going up. Is that snow? I think that's snow. Where are we right now? Huh. I don't think I've ever actually been up here. Interesting. It's a whole bunch of new stuff for me to explore then, I guess. Which is always fun. That is the main draw of the game. Running around like a headless chicken trying to explore everything. I'll go this way. Up a tree. That looks like a place a Korok would be if I ever saw one. Oh, what was that? Oh, hello, Choo Choo. Oh. Oh. Take that, Choo Choo. Wait, there's another one? There is another one. Ha ha! My Eightfold Blade, no! It's, it's okay, I got another one. I got two Eightfold Blades. <laughs> ah, yes, this is a place where there's a Korok. You can tell because of that ring. What is this? Is this a hot spring? It is! Ah! So gotta go up there and dive off, and that's how I get the Korok. I, I do admit, having like diving challenges in games is always fun to me. And I don't know why. Hello, Monzuo Fox. Okay, goodbye, Monzuo Fox. I'll get you next time, though. Get the rush room. Yep, and then there are those those other shrines I was talking about. These ones are annoying. So what, what these shrines are is I want to say it's like a a four by five grid of orbs. And you have to figure out where each orb is. Or the, the correct place that the orbs need to go in that grid. And I want to say there's like five of them. So with 20 possible slots you have to figure out which ones they go in and then and, and the answer is is where the orbs in the other shrine are it's a very annoying puzzle i hate this puzzle so much just because it's so slow because you can't figure it out by yourself you have to do the thing yeah it, it's not a puzzle you yourself can figure out and that's why i don't like it Also, apparently I, I missed. <laughs> oh, maybe just this one, instead of going all the way up there. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> you found me. Bye bye buddy. <laughs> Another thing I, I don't particularly like about this game is the water controls. And how the dodge locks you in when you decide to dodge in the water. Because once you do that, that's it. You're locked in. You can't move. That's kind of annoying. I don't particularly like it. Ah, yes, this area. I remember this place. Okay, never mind. I have been here before. <laughs> it just took me a while to remember. Uh, I want to say there are... So, so, you, so you know how we saw those th that big skeleton dude? Well, over here, there's like three of them, and each of them has a little thing that you have to put over there. I think somewhere over there, there's like a there's like these three dishes, and there's and each of the big monster dudes have like this one glowy orb, and you have to go and you get that glowy orb, and you have to bring it to the central area. I think that flag. Yeah. So the, there are two ways you can do this. Either you defeat the monster 
and well, when you defeat the monster, they drop everything, including all the weapons that they have on them. Because they have a whole bunch of weapons. My goodness, the amount of loot that the uh, the big boys have is ridiculous. But at the same time, they're also kind of difficult. Not really, though. They're, they're a fairly simple fight, but I don't feel like fighting them at the moment. What I want to do is I just want to climb up this mountain. Let's see where. Yeah, I'm almost there. Do, 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 do. Wait a minute. Hmm. Come on, poke up your head. There you go. Mm. Do, do, do. So I need to get one of these rocks into that thing over there. Ah. Well, that didn't work. Wrong button. Here. Here. Maybe right there-ish. I don't want to fight one. Fine, we'll do it this way. The boring way. <laughs> okay, never mind. That seems like a good angle, right? That's because it is. <laughs> you found me. Rock seed obtained. Buh bye buddy. There's one down. There's two down. There's three down. <laughs> Electro keys. Don't mind if I do. Oh, oh, just an electric key. Electric key swing. A rare electric key swing. The part of the electric keys that produces electricity is not in its wings, so it won't shock you. Toss it in with some critters to make elixirs. And they just have normal eyeballs. One of many ore stockpiles around Hyrule. Oh, yep, give me back my arrow that I accidentally kept missing with. Topaz, this precious yellow gem contains the power of electricity. It's been known to fetch a high price since ancient times. Ruby, a precious red gem mined from large ore deposits found throughout Hyrule. Rubies contain the power of fire and have fetched a high price since ancient times. Mm, broken. More broken. Mm, busted. Hey, got an opal though. Do -do. The secret of water. The secret is that you can make these little pillars for you to catch your breath so you don't just have to go like in just one big thing. So if you think that you can't swim an area, you can just ice pillar hop from one to, to the next. Do -do -do. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, wait, what was our original, um, goal again? Try to get the climbing gear right. Yo, though. Cow. Dang it. Well, that didn't work. Get back here, cow. I was supposed to get a clean headshot, but that didn't work. Stop moving! There he goes. Curses. And he despawns. Yo, wait. What's a Korok flower? Thought I was gonna get a headshot. No. Oh well. If I got a, if you get a headshot on a prey animal though like that, you you just instantly get um, you you it, it's an insta gib, and the animal gives you all the meat that it would have. Where to next? 
I am actually not sh there. Oh, I heard it. It's close by. There it is. Do -do -do -do. Do -do. One more? Oh, you know, not one more. That was the white one. Okay. You found me. Korok seed obtained. Thank you, buddy. See you later, friend. Uh, so now we get to go back up there. There's the jungly place. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. But yeah, the other um, climbing gear, it's somewhere over there. And on an island somewhere over here. I don't remember which, though. Oh, there's too many clouds in the way. I can't see it clearly. Oh, well. Oh, my goodness. I have veered off course something fierce. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do 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 -do. If only I had my horse with me. Unfortunately, I don't think you can actually get the horse to this location. Naturally, I think... Actually, no, maybe. But it takes a lot of finagling with the horse. So... Do -do -do. All right, where is the shrine? It should be somewhere over yonder. Ooh, a black moblin. Where? Somewhere over here, apparently. I don't know if I missed it again. Hmm. Confuzzled. Not 100% sure of this thing's location. I will find it, though. Where is this shrine, though? Not this way. This way. Where is this thing? <laughs> Maybe it's up there where that tree is? Somewhere over here, perhaps? Somewhere over here. You know what? At least I get this herb. That's a win, right? So confused. It's close by, I just don't know where close by. Maybe if I get higher, I'll be able to see it. Maybe up here. This seems like a good lead. Hello, tree. Well, it's not over here. Yeah, I'm so far away that the symbol actually uh, disappeared. Shrine nearby. Pretty much moving in a straight line towards it. Tree. That is an odd looking tree. I'm going to check out the tree. Obviously, the tree doesn't have the shrine, but maybe I'll be able to see the shrine from there, right? Do some reconnaissance. What secrets do you have for me, tree? Do you even have any secrets? Because you are. Oh, you have a beetle for me. Dang it. Wasn't able to get to the beetle. Oh well. Anything else? A tree. Show me your secrets, tree. Maybe there's something up here. Like this rock. That's gonna have a core rock. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? You found me. Well, bye. Hmm. Where is this thing? No. 
It's not in the forest. I'm so confused. <laughs> Like, it's telling me it's over here, but I see nothing to support that claim. I'm moving, like, directly towards it. Somewhere around here. Ah, okay, I understand. I made this way more complicated than it need to be. Noted. I don't think I get any fish with that. Oh, well. Like now. There we go. There it is. Oh my goodness. Totosa Shrine. Okay, let's see what puzzle you have for me. Do, 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 do. Oh my goodness. That took way longer than it needed to. Uh, it can be pushed by the wind. While jumping from a high place. It enters bullet time. Alrighty, let's see what this one has. Totosa Apparatus. Ah, these ones. Okay. Yeah, I have to use the... I, I have to... Ooh, oh, hey, box. Don't mind me. What you got, huh? Shield of the Mind's Eye. Another shield. Your inventory is full, though, unfortunately. Well... Do, 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 do. I don't really need this shield. Especially if it's a shield that's just better by a factor of six. Going from 10 to 16. Don't mind me. Do, 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 do. Alrighty, this one. Ah. Uh. Oh my goodness, I hate this. That's right, I have to like face it at the switch, right? Move it that way. Tilt it. Tilt it back. B. X. X. Ooh, a bit steep, but you know what? We'll work with it. Alrighty, on to the next one. Do, 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 do. Make the controller face the switch. Well, you know what? Might as well. Like, something like this? Yeah, something like that. Nice. I get both of the treasure chests. Yoink! Do -do -do. Let's see, a small key, a key that can unlock doors inside shrines. Oh, so I needed that anyway, okay. Reset it. Fantastic. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Well, yes, they are an absolute pain to manipulate. These are very fun puzzles as well. Oh, dang it. Whee! Well, let's try that again. <laughs> Oops. Ow. Do, do, do. There we go. Yoink! Use the key, open this thing up, and the shrine is completed. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. Bro, 
broken. Thank you very much. Force on us overcomes the trial speaks of a hero. Here, have this rock I found. Thank you very much, good sir. I now have four. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Thank you. Also, I have pink lemonade, by the way. <laughs> Catching the grassy field makes it hard for monsters and enemies to detect you. Yes, the grass. The grassy grass. My horse is nearby, right? Yeah, if I remember, he's like right down the stream. Well, on the other side of it. Not this one, but close enough. All right, Troy, you need to bring me in the opposite direction, please. Do -do -do. And we can tell those other guys that we found the treasure and they can be like, what? What do you mean you found the treasure? You weren't supposed to find the treasure. We were going to find the treasure. And I'll be like, you snooze, you lose. Also, meta knowledge. I'm going to be like, meta knowledge? What's a meta? It's when you use information outside of the game. To do stuff inside the game. Ah. After all, why would Link know that that treasure place is right there? He wouldn't. Mm. I would, though. I bet it's over there. You again, pin mind of my little bro's treasure from before. He's got a pinch, so Miss Ghost Treasure. Well, da da. Why don't you just tell him? Do do do. Well, blah blah blah. blah, blah. That's a good point. After nothing, blah blah blah. Miss Go, the great bandit. I'm no fool. Do do do. Your great deck. I already found it, though. You just learn what we know. Oh, you know, I, I guess I just have to do this to get the information anyway. Heh. <laughs> Good deal. Way to go, Dak. You did it. Mm. The, little twin, the little twin steps over the little river. My cave rests above that river's source. Let's go hid the location of the treasure in some kind of strange secret code. I heard this from a former dog walker of one of Misko's underlings' descendants' neighbors. As solid a lead as any. I don't know about that. That seems like super shoddy. Just knowing someone with good intel like that? Exactly what I expect from you, Dak. Hey, I did it. Little twin, blah, blah, blah. Almost there, just a little bit more, and I'll have the whole thing worked out. Get out of the- Get out of here, man. That's- That's amazing. You've almost got it figured out. I already solved it. Humph. You're lying. Yeah, definitely lying. There's just no way a rookie like you can solve that puzzle before Dak. Not a chance, but I did. Tell this guy to beat it, Dak. Quiet, person. I'm trying to think. Ugh. I just need a, a bit more time to solve this. Let's go the Great Bandit. Complete. Woo! Come on over. Hey, welcome. Oh, you appear to have a bladed rhino beetle. Beetle loves bladed rhino beetles. Would you consider giving it to me? Uh, you'd get something in return, of course. How about I trade you for this meat and rice bowl? It's a deal! Mighty meat and rice bowl. Grants a low-level attack power boost. This dish of rice and lightly seared meat is a mainstay all throughout Hyrule. <laughs> Whoa! Thank you so much. You're even more awesome than I thought you were. I will cherish this beetle. You have... Bleh. I will cherish this beetle you have given me for the rest of my days. Anyway, back to business. What are you looking for? Are you selling? Look what I've got, oh. fool. What would you like to sell? And also, I'd actually like to organize everything first. Do -do -do. Well, for one, these pants. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. Did you need anything else? I'll buy anything. Here, have this old shirt as well. Thank you very much. Do you have anything else? Do do do. Uh, I guess I could get like th get rid of three of these. That'd be ninety rupees. Sure, have at it. Do do. -do. Three of these. Seven hundred and eighty. Don't mind me. Do do do. And I'll keep everything else for now. Thanks for your business. What do you got anyway? Actually, I'm also going to move my face up a little bit. There we go. Arrow, arrow, restless cricket, hot frog. 
I'll just, oh, yeah, I'll, get, uh, uh, I'll take them all. Well, 60 rubies. Yeah, I still made a profit, technically. 47. Thanks for your business. Do you need anything else? No, have fun, Beetle. Thank you very much. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do 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 Map. We follow the road. The main road. Okay. Now we're actually going to be trying to, um, what you call it, get the armor now. Might have taken a little bit, but hey, we're, we're better late than never, I guess. So, yo! That's a lot of apples. Mm, bop. Really? Okay, fine. There we go. Apples. All the apples. Seven apples. And some wood. Nice. Why is there a random rock here? Hello, random rock. Oh, you're just a random rock. Okay, see you later, random rock. Some of these things are actually active. I just don't remember which ones. Wait a minute. I heard that. What was that? And yeah, there it is again. Ah, pinwheel. Fine, I'll go I'll go around it then. Don't wanna cooperate, stick. Alright, what do you do? There's an acorn. Traveler's bow. Where exactly? Like right here. There we go. There's one. And where? Oh, right there, right? A little bit up more. Maybe a little bit higher. Oh, dang it. I will get you. Mark my words. Where's the apex of it where it slows down? Like right there, right? Hey, I got it though. Got it with a crit because the bow shattered. You found me. Crocs seed obtained. Bye bye. Bye bye, buddy. I'm out running low on bows. Do -do 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 -do. Mm, explosion. Ooh, what's in here? An emblazoned shield. This shield features a traditional design from Nekluda. Its combat capabilities aren't much better than the standard wooden shield, but it's, but it found popularity for its design. But my inventory is full, so. What about this one? An opal. You know what? I'll take it. Mm. As for the shields, though, yeah, I don't. I don't really need them. I have better shields. I don't need a tier three shield. I want better shields. I want like tier seventeen shields, tier forty shields. Those type of shields. Do -do -do. What's in here? Another iron sledge. I'll take it. <laughs> nice. Yep, they are in fact coming over here. Go away, bees. I said go away. Do, 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 do. I got the honey now. Courser bee honey. Bunch of apples. Do, do, do. Come on, there we go. There we go. And some wood and more apples. You can never have too many apples. Open. Hello. What's this? There's a worn-looking book here. Would you like to read it? Yes, yes, I would. 
When a dark light resides in the cursed statue's eyes, pierce its gaze to purge the seal from the shrine. Okay. What was it again? Is that that's a riddle? When a dark light resides in the cursed statue's eyes, pierce its gaze to purge the seal from the shrine. Okay. Simple enough, methinks. Hello, Choo Choo. Do, 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 do. That's what I think of you, buddy. But where is this shrine exactly? Whoop! Mushrooms, though! Ooh, piece of candy. Hello, Princess Zelda. I do not know the purpose of your journey, but there is a place I recommend you pay a visit to. Deep in the recess of Mount Lanaru lies the Spring of Wisdom. It is a storied spring to which I'm, I am making a pilgrimage. Oh. The Spring of Wisdom at Mount Lanaru. It is a storied spring. You can't tell me you're not curious. Care to visit it? Yeah, just a little bit. Okay, that's interesting. Hello, other person. You want me to point out some local areas of interest? Sorry, but I only talk about horses all day, every day. Although, if you head east from here, you'll find the ruins of the old horse training ground. It's pretty important. Shows up on maps and everything. Sounds like it's got a bit of a monster infestation going on now. Hmm, interesting. You have more mushrooms, though. I do enjoy me mushrooms. I can just set these boxes on fire. Hello, Choo Choo. Ooh! Red Choo Choo Jelly, a jiggly substance that normally comes from a fire Choo Choo. It consistently gives off heat if struck. It will explode in a ball of flame. Iron Room. Interesting. Let's go, giant horse. Come on, Troy. We got places to be. What's going on over here? Ooh, radish. Oh, a shrine. And a dude. Hello. Ha! Huh, let me guess. You got wind of the great Dr. Caleb's groundbreaking research and just had to meet him for yourself. Hey. No. Don't tell me you've never even heard of me after I've dedicated my life to researching the ancient shrines. Sigh. Well, you better remember my name, for it's not the last you'll hear of it. And while I'm at it, it's Dr. Caleb, if you please. I didn't study my rear end off to be called Mr. Caleb. Everyone forgets I'm a doctor for some reason. Ah. And since you ask, I'll inform you that I'm engaged in analyzing ancient texts. I haven't time for idle chit-chat. Ancient texts? Mm -hmm. Soon, my long years of research will be revealed, and all the world will hail it as the discovery of the century. Oh, do tell, Miss Dr. Caleb. To prevent any undue attention, I haven't even told my family about my work. You understand, I'm sure. Of course, Dr. Caleb. Gotcha, Caleb. Mm. Doctor. Oh. Did I just hear you call me doctor? As in, not merely Caleb, but Dr. Caleb. It rolled off your tongue so naturally. It was downright salivary. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I don't know about you, that's, that's, that's a bit weird. Hmm, this changes things. Oh. Very well then, I'm feeling charitable. So I'll let a few things spill. This is just between us, understand? Okay. When a dark lake resides in the cur, pierce its gaze. Oh. I'm still in the process of deciphering that one, so I don't suppose there's any harm in sharing it with you. That's my life in a nutshell. Days filled with researching shrines and nights spent studying ancient texts. That leaves no time to converse with passing strangers, so farewell! Cursed statue. Huh. You know what, speaking of cursed statues, how about we... Get this bundle of wood, throw it down here, and make it night. How, how about we do that? Mm. It's night time. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, hey, 
would you look at that? Hey, friend. Broken. <laughs> Woo. Amazing. Such a strange puzzle. Woof. I solved the puzzle. Ooh, there's rocks up there. Salt. Joy. Oh, I missed. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. More salt and some flint. Ooh. Spiffy. Come a rog shrine. Ooh, what's that? It is mushroom. Doo -doo -doo. All right, let's see what this puzzle is then. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ice arrows. If you find yourself surrounded by an overwhelming number of enemies, try using ice arrows to freeze them in their tracks. Mm, yes. Frosty. Do, do, do. Let's see what this one is. Trial of Passage. Okay. Ah, this one. Okay. I remember. Let's see. Don't remember that, though. Oh, my goodness. Do, 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 do. If you could do me a huge favor and just wait here. Thank you. There we go. Where's that last one? All the way over yonder. Stay down. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about giant metal bowls trying to puncture my face. Did I say bowls? I meant spiky death traps, not bowls. Do -do. Open this. What is in here? An opal! A very bowl that gives off a mesmering thing. Ah, now it's going backwards. Interesting. What do you have? Soldier's spear. Your inventory is full. No, it's not. <laughs> do, 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 do. There we go. See, not full. It's missing something, see? Soldier's spear. Still making it go this way. Wonder why that is. What if I did that one? Still spinning. What about this one? Now everything's paused. Zoom that. I can get on this one. Fantastic. Oh, dang it. Well, now I have to wait. I have to wait for the thing to come back around. Joy. Then I have to wait for it to come back around again. Double joy. Actually, no, I think I only have to make it... Wait for it to come... To, for, for this one to get around. Oh, there we go. Hey, puzzle solved. Hello. Do, 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 do. Mm, broken. Mm. Pink lemonade. Thank you for the spirit orb. I now have five. Only three more. So don't get too greedy. There's even more rock deposits. Yo, that's a gold one. How's it going? It's going amazing, Taz. We have made absolutely no progress when it comes to the main goal of the stream, which is to get all of the uh, climbing gear. But 
We've explored a little bit, gotten some stuff, some new weapons, found some Koroks. All in time, have an apple statue. You found me. Korok Seed! Bye bye, bye bye, buddy. Do -do 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 -do. Iron Sledge! Broken! Let's see, what was I doing again? That's right, I was getting up there because there's a gold ore deposit. And that means money! Well, it, it, not exactly money, just precious ores. Not ores, gems. Do -do -do -do. At least I'm pretty sure they're not ores. Do -do -do -do. Oh, rock salt. Rock salt is not an ore. Ruby, sapphire, and topaz are gems. Gems that I now have. Joy. Oh, there's another shrine nearby. What? Oh, mushroom. Oh, and a beetle. Oh, well. We don't get the beetle. Oh, there's a rush room up there, though. Mm. Nah, it's raining, so now I can't even get up there even if I wanted to. Oh, well. Oh, oops. Sorry, Monsieur Fox, you are in the way. I didn't even see you there. But to be fair, I did say you. I, I did say I was gonna get you next time. Dang it! Silence. Dang it! Oh, it's raining. That's right. I can't actually make those things explode because it's raining. Dang it. Lance. Well, soldier's spear, not a lance. Technically, a, la eh, a lance is a type of spear. Ooh. Only two. Two hits in the round. Puzzle complete! Oh, it's not really a puzzle. Puzzle would have been done a lot faster if it wasn't raining. Because then the barrels would actually explode. Is it actually raining raining? Let's see, fire arrow? Nope, fire arrow's still active. Hmm... Yeah, Link, just drop an explosive barrel like it's nothing. Thanks, buddy. Oh, my goodness. There's another one over here. We had more arrows and a horn. Alrighty, let's see what's in this treasure chest. Yeah. And it's a whole lot of opals. Okay, you know what? Fair enough. What? What? Oh, people are being chased. Oh, no! Yeah, that's one way to react when bokoblins are trying to kill you. I only need to whack them twice, though. Doo -doo -doo. Thanks a lot, buddy. You're out of here. Did I save you? Are you guys done freaking out? Thanks, I was starting to sweat until you showed up. Electro Prime Meat Curry. Grants low electricity resistance. The high quality meat in this curry has given it a deeper taste than most other curries. <laughs> Neat. Time to stop foofing around here. Let's get back to the hunt for hearty truffles. Oh. Traveling all over to find hearty truffles. I know, I know. It's dangerous for two folks to travel on their own these days. But you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> But when I think about how wonderful those truffles taste, all the worries and warnings melt away. Ah. Find hearty truffles. All right, and you're just going to re repeat. Okay, noted. Can't believe we're alive. We're minding our own business, hunting for truffles, and then wham! Monsters out of nowhere. 
I blame my sister, really. She's the one who refuses to go home until we find some hearty truffles. <laughs> Why is there just a random rock here? Because it's just a random rock. <laughs> Noted. Miam Agana Shrine. Do do do. Do 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 do. Skip. Let's see what this one has in store for us. Restoring hearts. Ah, lemonade. You can replenish your health by consuming fruits and food. What's this puzzle got for us? Miyamagana apparatus. Another apparatus one. Okay. Ah, these ones are fun. Okay. Contr get it to where the ball exits the thing. Be very careful. Oh, no, no, no. More careful than that. Level it out. Woo! Okay, never mind. Dang it. Can I cheat? Kinda. Not really, though. Do, 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 do. No! Ah, so close. I think I can cheat. Yeah, that's because I can. There we go. I just need to leave it like that. But I have a chest I need to open, so... Okay, never mind. Noted, it needs to be lowered a bit more. Just a tad. Something like this? Hmm, maybe not. Maybe just make it lower. Let's see what's in here. A, f a fre phrenic bow. A bow passed down through the Sheikah tribe. Concentrate before drawing the string while I need to target distant enemies as easily as those nearby. Oh yeah, sniper bow. I forgot about that. And now we complete this. And then all of our hearts get restored. And then we get to move on to um another place. The other place. Up the mountain. So I can try to get that uh the climbing gear. To overcome this trial speaks of the promise of a hero. Thank you. Spirit orb given to those who have overcome the challenge of a shrine. Only two more left. Those two being the climbing gear um, shrines. Nice. Taking a while, but hey, we'll, we'll get there eventually. All we have to do is just follow this road. We'll do the story quest later. We'll talk to NPCs later once I have my climbing gear and all that. But until then, no. Eyes on the prize. Prize being some very nice gear that allows me to climb very, very fast. You know what I should do? I should also make myself like some food. Because I have no idea how cold it's going to be up there. There's one. A soup ladle! A kitchen implement often used for serving delicious soups. It was carved from the wood of a sturdy tree, so it actually packs quite the wall up. <laughs> Spicy fruit and mushroom mix. Nice. Steamed fruit. A regional dish made by steaming near ripened fruits in the leaves of fragrant plants. Spicy elixir grants a low level warming effect, increasing your resistance to cold environments. Very useful when exploring snow covered mountains. Spicy elixir, 1040. Alrighty. That should be more than enough for what I need. Zone number one. Get to where the mountain is. The big snowy mountain. This one right here. And then after that, I go to the beach and I try to find a boat. And then I sail to the next place. Sheep. Can I get the sheep for meat? 
No, no, I cannot. The sheep are just angry with me. Noted. These are what you call friendly. I'm not allowed to attack them. Yeah. You found me. Peroxid. Yeah. Bye bye, bye bye, buddy. Yeah. We. Alrighty, and now I'm over here. Nice. Oh, shroom. There's mushroom. Also, a bunch of other stuff as well. Oh, sun shroom. There we go. Gonna need some of these bad boys. Iron shroom, iron shroom, another sun shroom. Bunch of sun shrooms, actually. Actually, just a lot of mushrooms in general. Okay, it's now cold. But how cold exactly? Am I currently freezing? No, I'm just fine. That's good. Purple stuff. This must be Mount High, uh, the other mount that she was- Oh, wolves. Okay, noted. Nope, nothing. Okay. See you later then, I guess. Oh, Lizolfo. An icy one, though. So that means I can just... Do that. And he goes away. Icy Lizolfos Tail, the severed tail of an ice breath Lizolfos. Its hard scales and flesh make it unsuitable for cooking, but it's perfect for making elixirs. Lizolf Forked Boomerang. Blue Lizolfos in particular like this weapon. It has one more blade than, Liz than the Lizol Boomerang to give it additional cutting power, and it still returns when thrown. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, go buy a spear. Yeah, it's become very cold. You'll take damage even when... Okay, so now I can use the thing. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. I have the resistance. However, I do not have the snow boots. <laughs> yeah, it's down here. Okay. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. Nope, wrong one. There we go. Do -do 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 -do. Explosion. Tano Al Shrine. Open sesame. Pink lemonade. Give us. Well, not the dumb, so we can solve the puzzle, please. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it's blue. There's water. Oh, this one's just a reward one. That's right. Yeah, Tano Al's blessing. Nice. Not even a puzzle, just free stuff. Climbing boots! Climb speed up. These rock, rock climbing boots have special no-slip toes that help you cling to walls. This ancient technology facilitates more nimble climbing. There we go. Bam. Now I just need the torso. Mm, broken. Joy. You have done well to arrive at the shrine. A hero rises to right the wrongs of Hyrule. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. Thank you. May the goddess smile upon you. Thanks, dude. Hot springs. These lush thermal baths are found throughout the world. You can relax in them for a while to replenish your hearts. They're not very, they're not very common, though. Like, the only place I know for a fact one spawns as well... That one area that we dived into earlier this stream, and pretty much like a very ooh, chill shroom often found at the base of pine trees in cold climates. These mushrooms are cool to the touch and can be used to cook dishes that allow you to stay cool even in arid regions. 
But yeah, that, um... Korok that we found, like, very early on. The one where we had to dive into the Ring of Lily Pads. That's, like, the only other hot spring I know of besides the ones over in Death Mountain. A wild berry, a fruit that grows in cold, snowy regions. Known for its tangy, sweet flavor. It doesn't offer any special effects, but it's a popular cooking green. It's a raspberry. <laughs> nice. I love raspberries. Any other mushrooms? No. Okay. Now we're looking for a boat. A boat for us to get to an island. And that looks like to be a beach. That'd be a good place to find a boat, right? Go to the beach. Beach has a boat. Oh. oh okay, well. <laughs> Frozen crab. <laughs> Doesn't provide as much companionship as an unfrozen crab, but it won't spoil during your travels. It'll gain a temporary boost to your heat resistance. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Do 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 do. You found me, Korok Seed. Bye bye, bye bye, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Icy, hearty, blue shell snail. It takes a skilled chef to get the meat out of this frozen, hearty, blue shell snail. Eating this will provide to increase your heat resistance. But it's like not cold down here. Why are they freezing? Oh my goodness, there's so many rush rooms. What the hell? One, two, three, four, five. Six. Ups up, friends. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, fair enough. Mm, busted. What is this? The Zal Bow, a wooden bow created by the Zalfos. It's reinforced by the bones of a large fish. It, a marked improvement over any standard wooden bow. Okay. Upgrade. Yoink. And an arrow. Those are talons, horns. Okay, not that island, it's a different <laughs> island. That island is a very spooky island. That one. That's the one I want to get to. That island right there. That's an enemy rock, I believe. Yeah, that, that rock. This rock. That one right there, I'm pretty sure wants to kill me. I'm pretty sure. Not 100% on it, though. But I'm, I'm almost 100% there's a golem enemy over here. But where? Oh, well. Doo -doo -doo. Right here. Yeah. You found me! Peroxide! Bye bye buddy. <laughs> I believe I can also get some coconuts from these trees as well. Oh, rock. I do like rocks. You tried to fling your tongue at me, but you don't have a tongue. That's what I think of you. Hardy snail, though. 
hardy blue shell snail. The snail lives on, a san on sandy beaches in large numbers. Its flesh contains a high amount of stimulants. So when cooked into a dish, it tempor temporarily increases your maximum hearts. Nice. Another bow. I do like my sniper bow, though. So. I'll drop this one. Any coconuts? There are coconuts. Oh. Palm fruit. Fruit from palm trees that grow near the ocean. It doesn't offer any special effects, but will increase your heart recovery when used as an ingredient. shell crab. This crab shell is particularly hard. When cooked into a dish, it's fat and meat bolster the body to increase your defense. Oh, nope. Oh, I died. Okay. You know what? Fair enough. Let's try that again, I guess. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh my goodness, everything just hards resets. Okay, you know what? That's fair. Pay attention to your health more next time, Creed. Jeez. Oh, lizard. Hi, tail lizard. There we go. Palm fruit, yes, yes, yes. Snail. No snail. Snail gone. Poor snail. Oop, golden outcrop. Very nice. Oh no, you really want the sledgehammer. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. That's why I think of you, enemies. It's almost like the sledgehammer is designed for getting rocks out of the ground or something. Ooh, a ruby, though. There we go. What is this? Lizalfos arm. The arm of a stall Lizalfos that continues to struggle even in death. It can be used as a weapon, but it's very brittle. You can feel it wiggle when you strap it to your back. Mm. Again? No, go away. What's this? Dragon bone boko bow. Oh, that's why he killed me. A boko bow reinforced by fossils. But Calvin's hand picked the materials it's made from, so it boasts a respectable firepower. Soldier's bow. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Do -do 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 -do. Climb over that, because I don't want to have to deal with Lizalfos Liz harassing me in the water. That I don't even think I can make that swim. Not with the stamina I have and not without the um, Zora armor either. So we climb, we ascend, ascend the cliff face. Look at the stars. So pretty, so, so beautiful. I wonder if there's any constellations in this world, right? I mean, probably. There's an entire mythos and all that. I'd be surprised if they just ignored something like, uh, what you call it? Rip. How do I get rid of this? Well, not that. Oh, well. Uh, I could have just teleported back, but oh, well. I mean, I got some extra bows out of it. And, um... Some materials. Crab. 
razor claw crab. This crab is well known for its exceptionally sharp pincers. When cooked, the strength compound on its claws will increase your attack power. Sounds like bubkiss to me, but sure. Hello, keys. <laughs> Crab gone. Poor crab. Alrighty. And this is why we have the Korok leaf. Okay. Full speed ahead. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it's all foggy, all misty. Oh, they're blue. No, 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 don't attack them. Continue making the boat go. What are you doing, Link? Come on, speed. Yes, there we go, friend. Oh, really? A shrine nearby? I have absolutely no idea where it is, game. Do tell! What's this? Ow. Oh. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> we will, however, take some of this. There we go. Two wood this time. All right, let's activate this. Skip this. And what type of trial is this going to be? I know it's a trial of strength. I just don't know which one. I can build up energy. Our small trees are limited. A major test of strength. Okay, so this is extremely bad. Um... Normal arrows. Dang it. Uh, I have as as much armor as I can have. Food. I mean, stuff... Oh, that's not very long, though. Alrighty. Let's see how this works. Mm. Yep, you're a big one. Oh, goodness. Oh, dang it. Well. Noted, the laser instantly destroys the shield if you cannot reflect in time. Alrighty. So, new plan. Get the attack bonus right off the start. Mm. Nope. Oh, dang it. Note to self. It's actually kind of hard to reflect the giant laser beam. Okay, one more time. Let's see if we can do this. I hope I can do this. Maybe actually just try to get the... Okay, no, just die because I don't have a shield out. Yeah, that's right. Oops. I got this. I've done it before, I can do it again. Hello, friend. Come on. There we go, finally. Jeez, I knew it was possible. Oh my gosh. There we go, finally. Woo! We get all this in return. Ancient Battle Axe Plus Plus. 60, my goodness, this ancient battle axe's damage output is scaled up to peak performance. Ancient technology makes it possible to enhance cutting beyond metal weapons limits. Guardian Sword Plus Plus, the abilities of this Guardian Sword have been boosted to the maximum, as evidenced by its increase in size. Excuse me, it slices through armor like a hot knife through butter. Guardian Spear Plus Plus, this Guardian Spear's output has been boosted to the maximum. The spearhead is designed for optimal stabbing, capable of easily piercing most armor. Nice. Do -do 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 -do. 
Unfortunately, these weapons are not going to last very long. Because that's just the nature of how this of how the ancient weapons work. They do a lot of damage, but they're really fragile as well. But I get my armor. Ho ho. Let's see. Climbing gear! Climb speed up! The ancient technology in this gear will make you a better climber! The special no-slip gloves help you use your energy more efficiently to facilitate nimble climbing. Oh, Nice! And the attack buff just ran out. And I am now... Maxed get climbing man! I am the climber extraordinaire! Took a while, but hey! It is what it is. Do 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 do! Your tramp over the test of strength subverts a prophecy of ruin. From the ashes of Hyrule, a hero rises! Thank you. Spirit Orb! Woo! And I'll have eight. May the goddess smile upon you. Thank you, friend. If you have a fairy help you cook, the tonk you produce together restores a great deal of hearts. Really? Co Fairies can help me cook? That's a little weird, but okay, game. Come on, move it. Oh, -ho. gotcha. Do -do -do. You found me! Proxied! Bye 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 buddy! Alrighty, so now we can teleport back to Kakariko Village because there is something I want to do at Kakariko, which is to spend my spirit orbs for even more stamina so I can attain greater heights! Do 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 do. Whee! Alrighty. There we go. Oh. Nah, we have to we have to be like right next to it. Cover the shrines and claim their spirit orbs. I would like a stamina vessel, please. Yes. I shall grant the power you seek, thank you. Whee! Fantastic. Stamina vessel! Whoop! There we go. Yes, I would like another stamina vessel. Yes. And you shall grant me the power I seek. Thank you. Another stamina vessel. Yay. Woo, almost two. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Thank you, lady. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Guardian Sword Plus. Or plus plus versus just a normal guardian sword. Oh my goodness, there's actually a huge difference. Nice, rip and tear until it is done. Anyway, with that though, we do, 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 do. is the end of the stream. Wait, I need to unmute it. There we go. Fantastic. Well, yeah, we did what we wanted to do. We got all the climbing gear. Took me a very long time to do it, but at least I did it. And now we can climb stuff very, very fast, like the towers, like all the obstacles in the way of the towers. Oh my goodness, this map is going to be lit up something fierce next time we stream this game. Because, well, we're, we're going to run around and, and light it up. That's why. Yeah. Joy. Anyway, if you enjoyed your time at today's stream, consider doing the viewer things. Follow. Share. Check out my Twitch panels. I will see you all next time. Goodbye.